Hey guys. Sunday morning. Sun's up nice. And uh, I'm gonna come back over here to these soccer fields where I was earlier when I found that nice ring. And let's and let's see what we can find over here. Well, first coin of the day, penny. Well, I just had my second target, and it looks like it's the tip to a metal pin. Working my way over to a basketball court over there. I'm going to look around it. <clears throat> just found something besides a penny. Dime. It's pretty, pretty worn there. So I just found my first nickel for today. Okay guys, I don't think anybody's really metal detected over here because I'm finding coins, I'm finding all kinds of targets. Check this out, I just got a target here giving me a silver signal. Check that out. I think I found my first ring for today. Man, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. All right. Silver ring. Nice way to start off the day. Well, guys, just found this. I think it's like, is it the hood of a car? It says Electra Marvel on it. Anyways, I'll keep a looking. Well, I thought I might have another silver ring, but ended up being a quarter. And I just found my first pull tab. So I'm going around this basketball court, and I just had a cool find. Check this out. It's a gold panner. You're kneeling down. Pan and gold, and it says Golden Days 2000, Fairbanks, Alaska. And it's a it's a pen. It's missing the back. But check that out. That is pretty cool. I'll get a close-up picture of that at the end. But yeah, that's my first Golden Days pen. Cool. Well, I think I found one of those missing links that uh, Archeo Digger Doug's always talking about. It's a combination of an old, like, beaver tail, but like a new pull tab, too. Weird, you don't see those too often, at least here. I don't know about you guys, but I don't see those very often. Well, I like seeing these uh, flocks of birds, but uh, it just sucks knowing they're getting ready to leave for the winter. I just found a little coin spill. Two quarters and one nickel. Now oh, that little hole there. Well, here's the first part of that car I found. So I guess it's a truck now because I found the the bed of the truck. So maybe I'll find the rest of it. Well, I just had another target and I dug up this. Looks like it's copper. I scratched it there. Not sure what it is. Alright, I'll keep looking. Okay guys, I had another target here, and uh, I've got it in this. I'm not sure what it is, but I do see a chain. Kind of hard to do with one hand.
probably about as good as I'm gonna get it. Oh, you know what it is? It's a ring! Yes, it is. It's a silver ring. <laughs> Alright. Let me clean it up real quick. Well, there, I, bent, I cleaned it up and bent it out. Sweet. Second ring of the of today. I'll take it. So anyways, I've worked from over on the soccer field over at Anween. I've worked my way over to this there's Anween way over there. I worked my way around this basketball court and this is Ryan Middle School over here. So I'm just working along. They got a big track and field with a soccer field in the middle of it. And I'm working my way around the edges. So hopefully I'll find something else interesting. Okay, cool. I just found another small coin spill. Two dimes and a penny. Well, I just found this. Looks like probably a part to a bike or something. All right, guys, I think I found my third ring for today. Just kind of popped it up here. Haven't pulled it out yet. Oh, check that out. I scraped it, though. Look at that. I scraped it when I was digging it up. I don't know. It's heavy. It's very, very heavy. So maybe it could be silver. I don't know, sure looks shiny. A little bit too shiny actually, but anyways, hey, it's a ring. Check that out. Alright. I'll keep looking for a little bit longer. Well, getting ready to leave and go back over to this uh, soccer field over at Amween. Had a signal right by the gate. Flipped it up and check this out. Looks like I found me a matchbox car. Ah, boy, it's stuck pretty good. Check that out. Looks like a Corvette convertible. Cool, man. I've had the best day hunting so far. Alright, I'm going to look for a little bit longer. And then go get some breakfast and just watch the NASCAR race. I just found this target. I'm not sure what it is. Okay, so I'm scanning this uh, soccer field and uh, found this. Looks like somebody's dog tag. Hunter! Here in Fairbanks. Cool. Nice find. I love finding dog tags. So here's all the birds we've been hearing. This is Kramer's Field. Sandhill cranes, ducks, geese. Hey guys, this is everything that I found when I went over to uh, Ryan Middle School. And uh, it was right on the border of Ryan Middle School and Ann Ween Elementary. There was uh, a soccer field on Ann Ween and a basketball court on the other side of Ryan. So, anyways, found, uh, you know, some aluminum foil, old beaver tails, pull tabs, bottle caps. Uh, some of these things are plastic and they were just surface finds, like this little flower, a leg, whatever the heck that is. Uh, look at all the pencils I found. I found this crazy looking thing. And a lot of little pieces to lighters and hairpins. And here's uh, that missing link that uh, Archeo Digger is always talking about. It's a combination of one of these and one of these. Kind of weird. Anyways, that was cool. Uh, and found some parts here, not sure where they all go to. 
and uh, found, I guess this used to be like a pickup truck, I found the hood and uh, the tailgate, but I'm missing the cab. And uh, here's a little garter I found that was laying on the grass. And here's a Corvette convertible, which is pretty nice. Cleaned up pretty good. And then after that, I found 50 pennies. None of them were old. I found five nickels. I think the oldest was like a 1975. And I found 14 dimes. Oh, wait a minute here. Let's see. Five. 15 dimes. Overcounted there. And then I found one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine quarters. And the oldest one was a 1965. Oh, uh. I did find six nickels, but one of them, I, th I thought I found my first war nickel, but it ended up being a 1941 nickel. I cleaned it up and uh, it's pretty shiny, it's in good shape. Real good shape for being a 41. And then I found this dog tag. I cleaned it up. I'm going to call the people. I think they just recently lost it because it was laying right on top of the ground. Uh, I found this cool little, uh, they have a like a fair here called the Golden Days where they celebrate uh, gold being found in Fairbanks. And uh, this was a uh, Golden Days night, or a Golden Days 2000 Fairbanks, Alaska pen. It's a little guy squatting down with a gold pan. All the words are in the gold pan. So that's pretty cool. I'll show a close-up picture of that. And then I found three rings. This first one looks like somebody made it. Wire ring and then they soldered it together. Uh, this one here, I'm just assuming that's kind of like a stainless steel. I cleaned it up really good. And uh, took a picture of it before and after. I'll show you that. And uh, here's probably the best find for today. Uh, the silver ring that I found by the... I found all these by the basketball court. So that's probably a good place to look uh, if you guys are looking for a place to hunt. Search around those basketball courts. Anyways, it says uh, M.W. Sterling on the inside of this, so I did get a silver ring today. So a lot of cool finds. 41 nickel, three rings, the gold, golden days pin and the dog tag, and plus a lot of change. Had a good time. Hope you all are having a good summer and having good hunts. And until uh, next time, good luck, happy hunting. See you later.